Hey, I'm Billy Bolt, and you should follow Steps to Podium. What do you expect from Excella guys being your first time? It looks good, you know, like really super tough track, um, very technical almost, you know, too tough in some places. I think it's going to be like some places I've seen it's not possible to ride so then it becomes like down to fitness and physical condition as well. But no, it looks good, um, really tough. I think it'll be a, a, good, uh, a good opener to the, the West series. That is something that I can already tell you that you should get used to Malicia's races. It's mm. always like that. It's really you're gonna have to push. Yeah. And about the the terrain itself, do you have you felt any difference, like uh, super slippery? Yeah, it is super slippery, and it's very unpredictable as well. Uh, you know, a lot of the rivers, some rivers are dry and some are wet, and then some have a little bit, of, only a little bit of water, which seems to be like the worst um, the of the ones I've seen. Um, but yeah, every all the streams are slightly different, so you just have to you know look and read the line and. Um, I think for the like the first lap it won't be too bad, but the second lap when there's other riders in the main line um, and we have to go around them and uh, to pass them, I think then it's going to get really tough. And um, now something about uh, actually your career itself. You're just 20 years old. It's yes. ridiculous. 20 uh, years old, yes. You're super young and you're already riding on a super high level. How do you keep up? Uh, on that level, knowing that you do not have the same baggage or luggage as the other yeah. ones that have been... Uh, it's tough, like, in, in... I only really noticed that in, like, the racing environment and, like, the, like the making some stupid mistakes, which you think, uh, like, but you learn from them. Like, the more races I do, the more I've learned, and then, uh, you know, I'm not going to make the same mistake again, but... Um, you know, just training hard, I'm riding, like, a lot, trying to ride a lot. There's still a lot of areas I need to work on, you know, I'm still only... Uh, I ride an enduro bike for like three years, um, you know, before it was only trial, so there's still a lot of things and from like the enduro side and the, the speed area, which I want to work on and improve, and then uh, even from the extreme side, you know, I have the perfect teammate in Graham, and uh, just want to make the most of it, uh, having him around um, and learn as much as I can and uh, improve as much as possible. And just for everyone that's uh, at home, what would you say that for you are the two main things that uh, that you care the most or that you value the most uh, for the biggest performance that you can at home, uh, on track? Uh, you know, just to, uh, to push as hard as you can and to, uh, to give as much, give all that you can on the day, and then um, uh, you know after that, then for me, the, if I feel like I've performed the best I can, usually. The result is pretty good. If not, then I know it's you know it was the best I could do in the day. So for me, it's just um, to know it's always give your the best performance you can. Um, you have to worry a little about the other riders in the race and things, but really just for, for the kind of these kind of races and extreme races, it's it's good because you can really just focus on like yourself and, and your own race, and then uh, again, at the end of the day, it's it's, uh, it's how you've done it. First is more a uh, battle with yourself. Yeah, I think for me, it, I, I I get a lot from like my own performance and how I feel I've done. And even some races where I've had really good results, I've, there's some things I've been really not happy with, and like. That's what I thought about way more than the result was. Um, so for me, that's, that's one thing that I, uh, I like you know, think in the long term. Yeah, that, that, that's important to me to make sure I feel I've done all I can. Thank you so much, really. Yeah, no problem. Hope to see you, and uh, honestly, I have a great feeling that you can do really well on this track. Thank you very much.